and good morning. Welcome back to the Vape Rooms once again. It is unfortunately the last day of the weekend, but a bit of a silver line. It does mean you are graced with my presence today. But today, what have I got to talk about? There's a few things actually. So we'll start off with the usual. So I'm in here at Garston today to help you with any of your vaping needs today. And so that means that I've got the southern side of Maisie's side covered. But we also do have the man of many bow ties. He is in our West Derby store today to help you on the northern side of Maisie's side. So we you've pretty much got all your bases covered. But today, what have I got to talk about? Well, first of all, obviously I had the introduction. And then now you have my apology for yesterday. I did apologise during that video, but I was in a bit of a rush anyway. I had a bit of a manic day and I didn't even have time to get the video out. So, yet again, I do apologise about that. But, as a condolence, I'm here right now. I'm here right now. But, I'm still testing the new Geekby Aegis Boost, which is basically the pod version of the Aegis. Obviously, everyone knows about the Aegis series. You've got the original, the mini, the legend, the solo. So you've got a inbuilt battery, the single battery, the dual battery, you've got the Aegis X with the giant screen, which is another variation. But now you get to the boost, which is a pot system. They do also have an Aegis Squonk, which is a single 18650 battery, and that is obviously a Squonk kit. That's coming out soon as well. But I am testing the boost at the minute, and as I said yesterday, it certainly isn't letting me down. Image in a sec. Apologise about that, guys. As always, customers will walk in on our videos. And as always, if I if you don't want to be on video, that's fine. We do respect your privacy. We can always edit you out, or we can just always cut the video and you know start where we left. So as I was saying before, the Aegis Boost, giving it a little test there, see if I can find anything to improve with it. But to be quite honest, it's pretty steady at the minute. There's not a problem with it. It's a 40 watt pod, well, AIO system, but it obviously has this pod here, but it does have replaceable coils at the bottom. But I found not a problem with it yet. There's no leaking, there's no dry taste to it, the coils are working okay, the battery life is really good on it. I've got it pumping at 25 watts at the minute and it's holding up, not a problem. I have put it through its paces, even been vaping it at 30, 35, basically the maximum the coil it can do, and it's still holding up, not a problem. I have Neon Green Slushy by Element, got the salt nick run through it, and it is doing miraculously. Very good flavour, and the salt nick to it, ooh, ooh. You do feel it, but it's very, very pleasant. And, yeah, with it being Remembrance Sunday today, I hope your day is filled with a lot of huh, humbleness, respect, and a lot of gratitude to those armed forces that have unfortunately went away and didn't quite make it. But nonetheless, my respect and all my love goes to those who have given their lives to our country, our queen, to be quite honest, I'm not really the biggest fan of the royal family. I understand they are a big thing and a lot of people do love them. I just, do you know what, they're just another person to me. They're just another person who live in another really big house with a lot of people in it. But nonetheless, she is our serving monarch and for the people who've given their lives to our queen and country, as they say, You have my utmost respect for the lorries. For those who have come back, and for those who have come back and aren't quite the same due to many circumstances, of course, it, war and confrontations aren't really a, uh, a regular occurrence to us. But, yet again, you do have my utmost respect for you guys as well. And I will be doing a minute silence today in of course, in respect to you all, and that will begin in 40 minutes time. 
I had to check on the iPad because, you know, I'm using my phone for the video. But I will be doing a minute silence. I will have a sign at the front of the desk just to let you know that if you do walk in during my minute silence, just to let you know, I am doing a minute silence in respect to those who have been to war and either come back, come back not the same, or unfortunately didn't make it. And hopefully, if you do come in today during that period, maybe you'll join me. Because I know sometimes people don't really see the point, which is, you know what, fair enough. If you don't see the point, that makes sense. Me personally, I do find that, you know what, giving a minute silence to those, it doesn't take anything away from my life. And if anything, it gives more than what it takes. So, if you are coming in and, I don't know, maybe you've had some armed forces in your family who have been through the same experiences, hopefully you will join me too. And that is pretty much it from me today, guys. Just to let you know that I am here on a Sunday, open till four. I do apologise about yesterday. Manic, manic day. Didn't really get much time to get the video out. As you've seen, it went out at about 20 past six last night. And, yeah, with it being Remembered Sunday, hopefully you'll join me in the minute silence that we have in the store. But if not, not a problem. Hopefully you're doing your minute silence somewhere else. And even if you're not, Hopefully that you do just take a minute of reflection at least to give credit where it's due because the men and women out there who have fought for Queen and Country, some of them didn't make it, some of them did. Some of them come back with, I wouldn't say issues, but they've seen a few things that maybe us humans really shouldn't see. Hopefully you do have a sort of minute reflection at least for them because a lot of the times they've given up a lot more than what they've ever come back with and what they even had in the first place in some cases. And they do deserve the respect that they give because, as, I, as I'll be the first to admit it, some of us aren't really cut out for it. Some of us really aren't. And the ones who are, who have actually gone out there and done it, I can't, I can't give any more respect than I already give for them. I've had armed forces in my family. Some of them made it, some of them didn't. Some of them come back with some... Well, put it this way, they, they weren't the same at least for, for obvious circumstances. And yeah, that's pretty much it really. It's just to say, I will be joining in on my minute silence and I will be throughout the day reflecting on what they've done for us over the years with World War One, Two, Iraq, Syria, whatever it may be. And today, as you've seen this morning, I've done my, well, what we call the motivation boards. Today is a sort of, a little bit of a hat tip to the armed forces. For whatever circumstance they've been in, they've dedicated pretty much their time and lives to making sure that we are where we are and we stay the way we are and there's nothing really too much to say than respect respect to you but nonetheless join me today in the minute silence i do have hot coffee and freshly brewed coffee i might add i do also have all my cold drinks in like the monsters the iced coffees so on and so forth i do have the water machine pretty much filled up to today as well. So if any of that doesn't tickle your fancy, a bit of H2O can it. As you can see as well, pretty much stocked throughout the day as well. So not only could you join me for the minute silence, but you could get yourself something of something really, really top quality today. Uh, as always, out of the frame, I do have all my start kits, my tanks, basically any bit of hardware in today as well. So if you're looking for something a bit more on the hardware side of things rather than your juice, then I've got a lot there as well. But hopefully I will see you today, be it in a minute, in a couple of hours, whatever it may be. Hopefully I'm seeing you today. And if I am, as always, until then, I shall see you soon.